how soon will a time come when fighter pilots are replaced by heavy duty drones and artificial intelligence and what about the total replacement of human soldiers by robotic soldiers in the army and on ships in the navy very good question it's going to happen so in china let's say let's talk about china for instance in china they had these mig 19 planes in india we have the mig 21s the the mig 19 is i think the one of the world's first supersonic jet fighters it's a soviet design the chinese acquired some of these planes and then they created their own version of the of the mig 19 i think it's called the y16 i don't know what it's called y6 y16 something like that it's a chinese version of the, of the mig 19 plane so these planes are very old museum pieces but they have brought these back into service as flying drones as unmanned aerial vehicles so these are throwaway pieces that anyway belong in the museum if they crash it doesn't really matter so they have converted them into flying drones unmanned aerial vehicles so they will be remote controlled and flown as fighter jets or maybe as kamikaze aircraft aircraft flying bombs or whatever so that is what the chinese are doing the americans have converted some old aircraft and even some f16s into unmanned vehicles heavy duty drones you could say it's happening soon enough you will have drones that are completely autonomous completely ar ai powered that is also going to happen uh that is going to happen and maybe it's already happening we don't know so it's it's already it's all of this is already in the works uh the chinese have a very very uh, extensive drone program they have been investing in in drone technology for at least 15 20 years and they have a whole lot of varieties of drones that they have they have created over, over the years and tested and they keep on improving because they have this uh, research based university program they have universities that are only research based many of them you know so they have an academic industrial military research complex which we lack in india because our academic academic system is the 19th century colonial system which doesn't care about the future of the country so the chinese are going ahead in this the americans are also doing the same but india thus far is not a major player when it comes to drones we do have the rustam or something uh, unmanned aerial vehicle which is a remote controlled aircraft which is showing uh, good progress but we have a long way to go to catch up with uh, the cutting edge level technology so the time will be soon maybe in the next 5 10 maximum 15 20 years when fighter pilots are completely replaced with ai in uh, in fighter jets and the total replacement of human soldiers by robotic soldiers in the army and ships it may happen uh, i think we are still not quite close to that because uh, we still don't have the technology uh for bipedal robots i mean there are certain uh, companies in the us that have these videos of these dancing robots uh, dancing humanoid robots dancing dog robots and so on and so forth so they are uh, doing uh, significant progress in that but i am not sure if we are still at the, uh, close to the, to the to the point where these these robots could serve or could replace human soldiers maybe it could happen in the next 10 years perhaps so you could have these robotic dogs and robotic humanoids equipped with automatic weapons and other things it could happen in the next 10 years and also you may have the same sort of thing in the navy in naval forces so it's certainly going to happen at some point it could happen in the next 5 to 10 years roughly